Hi everyone, Larry Satchel here with yet another tea light. Um, let me catch you up on what I've been doing. This is a piece of maple, red maple, from our playground that blew down a few years ago. I milled it and it's been sitting on a shelf for at least three years. I really like the bark on here. It was stuck pretty well, except for that one corner where I glued it and it had a split down here. And I filled that in with black CA glue and I actually then, instead of trying to sand all that off, cut it off. And uh, you can see it's, it's really holding. This is a piece of redbud tree from Dana's first house. She had a redbud that was rotting out by the street. We cut it down. <laughs> it's been, I milled it up way back then, uh, at least 10 or 15 years ago, maybe more. I got these tea lights this time from Hobby Lobby. They have a taper to them. I decided I need a five, a one and five eighths inch hole. On the larger one, I decided I need a one and three quarter inch hole. So I used my um, Restore and sanded them all down. The 120 grit sandpaper with that foam does a beautiful job with this bark. This is just as smooth as can be. So now I'm ready to put a finish on them. On these, I'm gonna use an antique oil finish. And with this, it just really brings out the grain. You brush it on or wipe it on with a cloth, either way. I'm using a brush right now because I need to get down in here and get the edges here. You wait about 20 to 30 minutes, 15, 20, 30 minutes, and then you wipe off the excess. So by the time I finish the other one, this one will be ready to wipe off. And it recommends two coats, 24 hours apart. I really like oils. You can renew them really easily. I like the smell of them. I love the smell of this red bud as it's being milled. Very unique smell, very pleasant. Beautiful grain put this upside down so those holes can drain and it'll also give me access to the bottom here. All right, I'll let this soak in and uh, rub off that first coat. I'll come back when they're ready to display. Well, here they are, they still need a second coat. These candles came from Hobby Lobby. I think they were eligible for the 40% discount. They were $7.99 for 12 of them. But I really like the way these came out. I have a few more tea lights coming. I don't know if I'll get to them before Christmas. Thanks for watching.